In our rapidly changing world, you need to be prepared with the skills and knowledge to succeed in a rewarding career. Grand River Technical School will start you on your path for a lifetime of career success in a technologically advanced global society. Through hands-on learning, our instructors will guide and prepare you for your future, and you will graduate ready to take on the challenges of our skills-driven society. Since 1967, Grand River Technical School has been the leader in Northwest Missouri in preparing students for career and technical success. We offer 17 programs to fit the needs of diverse students who know what they want and believe our school can help them get there. Join us now in learning more about our programs and instructors at Grand River Technical School, where we make a career helping you find yours. Hello, my name is Justin Kretz. I'm one of the building trades instructors here at Grand River Technical School. We build houses every year for a customer. In our program, you're gonna get to learn how to frame, finish carpentry, you'll get hands-on experience in plumbing, electrical work, concrete work, all aspects of building a house. And the great part about our program, if you join it as a junior and take your junior and senior year, you actually get 30 hours of college credit towards the NCMC, towards an associate's degree. We have what I would call three classrooms. We have our actual classroom in the school, and then we have our shop at the school, and then we have the job site. The great thing is, instead of paying somebody $40 an hour to work on your house, you can take the skills that you've learned in here and complete a lot of them jobs on your own. Hi, my name is Chris Todd. I am one of the instructors here at the Grand River Technical School in the Building Trades program. If you decide to go into this field, it's great because the demand for people in this program to come out to be construction workers is probably as high now as I've ever seen it in my life. You can get out of this program, go right straight to work. You have no student loans to pay off. I'd like to encourage everyone to come to Grand River Technical School, visit our program, be in our program. Like I said, the job demand is there, possibilities are endless. So I'm Jana Schaefer, and our program here is the Hospitality and Tourism Management Program. It is a two-year certifying program. So juniors enter the program. It's a three-hour block. The program is certified through the American Hotel and Lodging Educational Institute. That certification helps entry-level employees be able to have a leg up on the competition when they apply. The learning is project-based and it is also on-site. We do things within this building and within the district that allows the students to have some event management experience. Then we take them into the community where they meet those that do event management, that run their own restaurants, that run hotels, and then they get to work side-by-side -side learning what the management side looks like, at the same time understanding just how important the entry level is. This is a program where students can build their own leadership of themselves, of their school, and within their community. I'm Arch Hassler. I'm with the Collusion Program. We work on a, every late model vehicle you can imagine. Everything that's out there that is driving has the potential to get hit and it takes a technician like you, if you choose to come into the program, to repair these vehicles. We do everything from structural panel replacement, cosmetic panel replacement, all the way to refinish. What can you do as far as uh, job opportunities in this industry? Everything from a painter, frame, mechanical, interior, sales reps, insurance adjusters, there's just so many things that spin from this program. What we're going to do here is expose you to every repair process on the vehicle. If you really take pride in what you do, my motto is really simple. I come here every day because I want to teach the world of auto body. I just need students who want to learn the world of auto body. I truly believe in we work hard, but we work smart. It takes people like us to, whether we customize a car or we put it back in original condition. If you take pride in what you do, come on in. I think you'll enjoy the program. Hi, I'm Susan Myers. I'm one of the three business teachers at Grand River Technical School. The beauty of taking business courses at Grand River Tech is you can come over as a freshman and take intro to business, but then we have opened up most of our other curriculum to be eligible for sophomores to take it. So sophomores, juniors, and seniors can create their own block. We find that students are really excited to take our classes because they are very hands-on and students 
students are learning things that they can take with them, whether it's personal or career-wise. It could be something they've learned in personal finance or entrepreneurship, business technology. Students are always finding skills and knowledge that helps them on the job. We get a lot of opportunities to place students. A lot of local businesses, whether it's an accounting office or a bank, will reach out to us to see if there's someone that, that maybe we could refer to them to be a good employee. So as you're looking over the classes that you'd like to take, consider taking a business course, whether that be to help you in your personal life or in your vocational experiences. We're happy to help you figure it out. My name is Lee Karn, and what I want students to know about this program is that upon completion of this program, they are ready to enter the workforce, either go into an apprenticeship with the boilermakers, or the iron workers, or pipe fitters, or even into manufacturing. Once they have completed this program, they are ready and prepared to go into the workforce. I'm Adam Melton. In addition to working hard, just be ready to have some fun. You're going to learn a lot. We just have high expectations of students and make you the best welders that you can be. Yes, yeah, students can be certified when they leave this program. And the American Welding Society, or the AWS, has pre-qualified certifications that our students take upon the end or the completion of their program here. Some of the certifications include SMAW, shield metal arc welding, flux cord arc welding, pipe welding. And as far as welding out in the shop goes, it's not always gonna be in a booth. You're gonna be working on projects for the community. Basically, if it fits through our shop door, we're gonna build it or fix it, whatever it requires. And as far as being in this class, graduating through it, the sky's the limit on where it takes you. And as far as goals for yourselves, always give it everything you got, especially in this class, because the more you put into it, the more you're gonna get out of it. I'm Sandra Sturgis. I am the computer science and a business teacher at the Grand River Tech School. Computer science, it's just about anything, but what I deal with is coding, software programming, really. There are programming available for everything. The government uses it, NASA, medical field, Cerner is one of the big ones that uses a lot of programming. There's a range of things out there. A lot of people will be familiar more with gaming, which is a big programming field. Um, we have businesses call here and ask us if we have any students that could possibly work after school or on weekends for them, and we try to encourage our students to go interview. They have the skills and they're ready to go into that field, and, and they think they need a job shadow, which is an awesome opportunity to job shadow to see exactly what they want to do. I really encourage you to sign up for classes, come on over to the Grand River Technical School, expanding what you know, great opportunities for your future. I'm Brandon Duckworth and I'm the computer service instructor for the Grand River Technical School. This class teaches everything you need about computers. Anything from the simple components inside to actually building your own computer if you wanted to. We also help with wireless networking and network infrastructure. If the students want to learn about servers or security, we also offer some options in that realm as well. We try to do as much as we can hands-on. We have projects throughout the year that students can work on, one of our biggest ones being the Chromebooks. We fix all the Chromebooks for the entire school district. It teaches the students on organization and, and the requirements needed to keep all these different devices, because we could be working on like 100 devices at the same time, knowing where they're all at at any point in time and knowing what we need to do. The students can also order the parts that are needed, otherwise they have to manage what parts we do currently have on hand. And so it gives experience into what IT can look like in the real world. There's many different jobs that the students can apply for, anything from help desk to field technician, copy repairman, security analyst, and server administration. The student can choose whatever they want to do. If you simply want to come in and learn about how to build a PC or how things work in general, it does give you a better leg up in this industry. With that being said, if you guys are interested in technology, I encourage you guys to come and see what we have to offer. My name is Tiffany Acri, and I'm the Early Childhood Professions teacher at Grand River Technical School. Students who take the Early Childhood Professions class have different opportunities. If they want to take their CDA and go straight into the workforce, there are many jobs available for them. That CDA sets them apart from other candidates, so they could be anywhere from a family child care worker. They could open and operate their own daycare. They could be a nanny. 
They could work in children's sales or children's activities like at the local YMCA. If they want to go on and further their education and get their teaching degree, then they can become a preschool teacher or early childhood teacher K through three. Clinicals are on a rotation basis. Right now, every semester they switch to something new. So by the time they complete the program, they have been in at least four different type of early childhood settings. Now the beauty of our program is after completing your two years, you have nine articulated credit hours that will transfer to NCMC. So for those wanting to further their career and become teachers, that is a big bonus to taking this class. So if you decide that this is the career you want, just know that you can make a huge impact on the interactions you have with the children you're working with now and in the future. I'm Bill Schaefer and I'm the Applied Communications teacher here at Grand River Technical School. Students are able to take embedded credit in English and math and for each year in the program they can get half a credit of English or half a credit of math and they do these assignments on their own and they don't actually meet in class but it's an opportunity for them to get math and English credits while they're still enrolled in GRTS programs and able to graduate on time and they don't have to fit those uh, classes into the regular schedule at their school. That's taught by myself and our math instructor Nancy Birch and our students have had a lot of success with it as well. The English that uh, you would be doing, the embedded English, I would certainly be geared towards the program that you're in so we will enhance your skills there and get you ready for the career and ready for success. My name is Nancy Birch and I teach the project Lead the Way engineering classes at Grand River Technical School. What we want potential students to know about the engineering courses is you do not have to want to be an engineer to take these courses. Topics that we talk about, the first course, the introduction to engineering design, you learn a lot about the design process. You will learn your computer-aided drafting. We'll do 3D printing, learn about how some things move together and work together. And we usually design two or three real-life items. I mean, the principles of an engineering course, which is typically the second course, there's more about circuits, robotics and sensors, material strength testing, and the computer-integrated manufacturing course. You'll review your robotic sensors. You'll learn about a CNC mill and robotic arms and then you'll put that all together and try and get them to communicate with each other. Even if you're not sure of your career goals, taking a Project Lead the Way engineering class may give you some ideas of some of your strengths and some skills that you don't see in your other classes that you may find out you really enjoy and want to go into or include as part of your future career. I'm Anthony Hennon. I'm an automotive technology instructor here at Grand River Technical School. We teach all eight areas of automotive, starting with the basics from tools, engines, transmissions, brakes, steering suspension, HVAC, and electrical. Through our program, students get the opportunity to learn automotive, but their career fields can be advanced from automotive service technician to diesel technician, on to power sports, service managers, service advisors, heart specialists. There's a lot of career field opportunities from what students will learn in our program. Through the course of the program, students will also have the opportunity to achieve certifications from AC Delco, Ford Motor Company, BG Products, and SB2 Safety. I'm Kenneth Estes. I teach engine electrical, brakes, steering and suspensions, and HVAC. We run a live shop. Most of the cars that we're working on are actually customer cars. In my program, I spend probably 30 minutes to 45 minutes a day on the classroom, and the rest of that time is actually spent in the shop applying the skills that we're trying to learn. Pick a career field that you enjoy. If you enjoy that occupation, you'll never work a day in your life. Hi, I'm Mrs. Sullivan, and this is Mrs. Daly, and we co-teach the Health Science Technology Program here at Grand River Technical School. Realizing that there will always be a need for healthcare workers is important when you decide on a career choice for the future. If you enter our program, there are so many opportunities for you in healthcare. You could start out and get a good paying career right out of high school with your state certification as a certified nurse assistant. We prepare you for advancing your education and your future, whether you're going on to college or in a different career of healthcare ranging from veterinarian medicine, radiology, ultrasonography, imaging, laboratory, nursing, physicians, surgery, physical therapy. The possibilities are really endless. You being able to experience all of the different things we have to offer here in our program, the one that fits you really just pulls you in. 
One of the things that you will get to experience is a clinical experience and we really strongly strive to get our students as much clinical opportunity as possible. We're not just training you for your life, we're essentially training you for everyone's life. Do make a difference in everyone's life by being a healthcare provider. Now that you've had a chance to take a virtual tour, we hope that you'll take some time to consider what kind of things are you good at, what are some of your interests, and how can you put those together for a career that you'll be successful in and a career that you'll find rewarding. We know opportunities are plentiful in career and technical education, and we hope to see you in our hallways next fall.